CBS The Bold and Beautiful Spoilers revealed that Stephanie and Eric set a surprise party for Carter at the Forest Creation Office. Time passes very quickly. Recently, Carter has worked up for 10 years at the company. He's capable of employee and he's given a lot. Stephanie and Eric both acknowledge that, and they plan to go to the pub to have a drink to congratulate Carter. But due to the rush of time, they chose to have a simple organization right at the office. They were also other employees in attendance, so Carter would probably have more fun. Recently, Carter has been having a lot of trouble in his personal life, and perhaps due to much lashing out, Carter couldn't concentrate on his work, even so people still trusted Carter. He's a strong man, so he'll definitely regain his spirit soon and complete his tasks what set out well. Carter was touched by the anniversary party Steffi and Eric organized for him. Carter doesn't think people will remember the first day at Forster Creations. A few months ago, Carter betrayed the Forster family trusted to love Quinn. Quinn is Eric's ex-wife, and the two of them also had an extramarital relationship. Carter thinks that Eric really lo- hates him and will never forgive him. But surprisingly, Eric didn't mind it. Nor did Steffi. They all appreciate the contributions that Carter has made to the company and appreciate it. That proves Eric and Carter both forgave him. Carter treasures this and will never betray the family again. Of course, he will also contribute more in his work and contribute to Forge Creations Company. Carter will prove Eric and Steffi right once in a while by putting their trust in him. Everywhere, Hope sees Deacon and Sheila together in Giordano's. Hope found the feeling very similar and familiar. It seemed that the scene Hope has been somewhere. And this was not the first time. Everyone knows Sheila and Deacon have a close relationship, but the two of them don't see each other too often. So why does Hope feel that these two get along so well? Like Hope had met so well. Like Hope had met Sheila somewhere. Maybe Hope didn't expect that Sheila was the same red-haired woman she had met when she went to Deacon's house. Sheila then faked her own death and disguised herself as someone else. Hope thought it was Deacon's new girlfriend and didn't care too much. And can Hope now recognize the woman as Sheila? Will this secret that Sheila's trying to hide be discovered by Hope? And can Deacon be justified then?